Okay, so I've done some sculpting on this character. And who am I? I've got my freaking cursor on. Okay. Um, what else can I say about this? I've gone in and I've taken the pants and I did some sculpting on them. I did some work on the shirt. I think it came in something like, uh-oh, like that. And I kind of worked it. And just did some quick details on it and the body. Uh, let's put this on solo. I don't think I can hit solo from here and I can't remember the hotkey off the top of my head. So, come on. <clears throat> yeah, let's go all the way back to the beginning. Uh-oh. I kept a long undo history on this one. Um, I don't know how necessary this is, but if I pull it, yeah, just so you can kind of see that I did some work and I played. I'm still not 100% satisfied with this character, but good enough. Where are we at? Uh, th active points, we got something like 3 million. Let's just go into the geometry section and... Uh, I guess I'm not at 3 million. Let's go down a little bit. Right there. Let's go down one more. Just, there, that should be good. Anyway, I'm just going to take these and I'm going to export them out. So as I export these pieces out, I've already got them kind of sitting over here that I'm going to export out. And I've done all these, all the separate pieces. And I plan to take them into Mari. So I'm going to go to Mari. And uh, here, let's just go and get rid of this and this. And I thought I was there, Mari. There we are. I hit new. <clears throat> and I'm just going to go find those pieces of geometry. And of course, uh, let's move some of this stuff over here really quick. And who am I? What am I doing? If I go into my projects, okay, great. And there we go. Scenes. And I'm going to take this one, hold down control, grab this one, this one, this one, and this one all at the same time. I think I should be good. And I'll hit open. Okay, create new project. And <clears throat> when I do this, it's going to think for a second. It's going to load all these pieces in. I didn't put them at their maximum polygon count, but enough that it's easy to kind of texture and get a good sense of what's going on. Um, I've noticed that Mori can take millions of polygons when you paint on them, but you don't necessarily need all of them. Okay, and it's thinking, 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 thinking. I might put this on pause. Nope, it looks like it's kicking in. Uh, I'm going to have to update my computer soon. I have this feeling it's been too long. Okay, I might put on pause. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I've got it here in Mari. And so I can paint pieces if I want to. I can go into the object section here and... I might keep my eyes around. There's my body. I might hide my boots. Ah, the boots I can keep around for a bit. Pants, shirt. I don't actually necessarily need to see uh, parts of this body. I might just texture the arms and the head. Okay, but I will kind of horse around with things because that's the way I am. Um, <clears throat> and if I pick out the different objects, like there's the body, Tamari. Um, Let's go in and start to potentially texture this. Uh, if I go in and let's take a look at the ortho view. And remember, this is kind of a beginner's um, beginner's uh, trip to Mari, where I would I could do a much more sophisticated job on this, but I'm trying to keep it relatively simple. Um, I'm just going to pause for a second while I get some images. Okay, so I'm just going to drag these in from Explorer. And when I go to Explorer and I just uh, drag them all in, bloop. So I have some handy dandy pictures and it takes a moment they load them all in. <clears throat> um, so let's see, the first thing I'm going to do is uh, let's go in and put on a bit of a face here. So I'm going to go in and drop this in. And when I drop it in, it's quite large. These are some pictures I got from... Uh, what is it? 3D.SK? Years ago. And I'm using them now. Um, and I'm going to pop this in. Actually, let's make this really big. And also, too, I'm just going to go right here, and there's this wonderful thing for mirroring. So I'm going to put a mirror line in. It's going to do some thinking for a second. Okay. And you'll see a funny little orange line show up here in a second. Okay, there it is. And um, I'm just going to get rid of the image manager for the moment. 
Um, I'm also going to make sure I've got a layer on here, so I got the base, and I'll hit plus, so I got another layer on top. You can name this layer if you want to. And uh, what else do I have? Uh, one other thing I should check in the painting section. Auto bake and clear is on. I'm going to turn that to clear only. And here we'll make this bigger. And I'm just going to go in and I'm just looking at where the mouth is and where the eye is. Something like that. That should be wonderful. And um, <clears throat> then uh, I'm going to go and use the paint through brush. And I can paint through. And okay, it's painting through. I'm painting on the positive X side. Here, let's make my brush bigger so I'll just slam it on. Okay. <laughs> and also we're seeing a little bit of speck here. Um, I'm going to switch now to my slurp brush right there. And the slurp brush, I'm going to make that a bit bigger. And the slurp brush kind of lets us kind of pull some of this texture around a little bit. We don't have to get too carried away with this. And I could break this into sections too. Um, let's just do a little bit more of this. That forehead looks awesome. You gotta be careful with the slurp. You wanna do little tiny nudges uh, one at a time, otherwise it does get really messy. And it looks too liquefied. Like already I'm already feeling I'm getting muddy. Um, that'll be good. And let's see what does that look like when I do the lips here. Uh, I'll probably come back and do this from the front view as well. This is just to kind of start blocking in what I'm looking at. And here, let's do some ear action. See, nudging little bit by little bit. Just clickety clickety click, 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 click. Okay, wonderful. And that might be a bit of a speck hit that I'm getting right there. That white area from the lights. That'll be okay. I find that this, strangely this texture really works with this character. Somehow I see it. Okay, and uh, what about a little bit of that? Now let's leave that alone. Nudgy, 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 and there. And uh, when I want to slap it down, if I just hit B for bake, it'll bake it on. <clears throat> okay, I probably could have brought this in a bit closer for you to see. Okay, we've got a funny, ugly gray line in the middle. Uh, maybe I'll go here to layers and I'll put on another layer. Okay, so it takes a second to think. I noticed that this doesn't work that well while I'm recording at the same time I'm doing Mari. Um, I'm going to go to the back of the head and I'll go to image manager and I'll grab another one. Okay, and uh, so we can position this back of the ears right there. Maybe I'll make this a little bit bigger and let's just rub that on. Now this time that I do this, um, see again we're getting that weird spec hit. Um, maybe I'll just go in here and I'll hide the other layer so I can't see it. And uh, when I'm over here we can also use the eraser. If I hold this down there's an eraser right here and I can take some of the information out of the buffer. So if I see problems before I'm actually before I actually get there. Okay, and then I can go back and grab my slurp brush and slurp that into place. Okay, and if also if I don't like the spec hits that I'm getting here, you can um, go right here and you can go flat. So you just see flat texture. Okay, and that looks like it's going to need some work in the back of the neck area here. And this is kind of like squashing all over my model. Okay, let's go and get the eraser again. Okay, remember if I, you can kind of see it over here, if I go ahead and I bake it down, if I want to get rid of some stuff, like I can see some extra crud coming over here, you can either mask it, sometimes the masks can be, you know, it's just unwarranted, you don't need it, you just want to destroy some of this crap, so like get rid of that. If I go to the paintbrush and I change the mode to clear, just remember you got to turn that off later on, if I go to clear, I can, while well, I'm on this layer, I can just erase stuff, completely wipe it out. I just hit B and bake it down. Go on this one, get rid of that chunk of crud. Bake it down. And bake it down. Okay, I think I got rid of that. I baked it. Yay! And, oh, look, I got some bad stuff on my head. Let's get rid of this. 
Okay. And again, I'm being really, really destructive. Not always the best of habits, but let's go to the other side. I really don't want to see this white stuff come back and haunt me. Like it's like dandruff. Um. <clears throat> okay, bake. And let's go back to layers and put on that other layer again, so we can kind of see what we're doing. Okay, and I got my half. Oh, that looks wonderful. Um. <clears throat> looks like I got neck issues um, that are going to have to be fixed and maybe I'll put another layer on here and I'm going to go ahead and put another layer and I'm going to turn off the uh, you know uh, let's hit five first off and I'll bring this down and I'm going to turn off the mirroring so there's no mirror remember you have to be in 4.2 in order to find that little mirror button Okay, come on, just a little bit faster. Okay, and um, then I'll go into uh, Image Manager again, and I got a front view. I'm trying to find something that's a bit more straight on. And I can hit the reset button up here, reset image. And okay, and again, I kind of look and try and figure out. Where the lips are. If you can't see through it that much, uh, what is it? The hotkeys are shift minus. Makes it more transparent. Okay, so you can kind of see a bit more what you're doing. And maybe I'll make that bigger. I'll get right about there. That's looking wonderful. And uh, then I'm going to go and use the paint through brush. Now, see when I'm trying to paint, nothing's happening. God damn it, I forgot to change from clear to normal. Okay. <clears throat> okay. And here we got something like this going on. And uh, again, I might switch to that eraser for a moment. Get rid of some of this white action up here. And I might get rid of some of that hair action right there because I don't need that. Okay, and uh, then what have I got? Anything on the side I don't want? Because this is just going to smear across the side and it's going to look bad. So I'm just going to erase some of this stuff out. Okay, good enough. And then I'm going to switch to my slurp tool and I'll do some slurpy action. And it's kind of hard to see what I'm doing again because of uh, the nature of this. Here, let's go back to shaded mode. So I'll put on the full so I can kind of see where the geometry is. Okay, and those eyes are bugging me, but we'll come back and fix those in a minute. It's going to make my tool smaller. I can't zoom in at this stage um, because my paint buffer will suddenly want, it'll change sizes too. So, okay, I don't care about the pupils that much. Um, okay. Let's just tweak up the eyes. <clears throat> oh, this is so rough and ruined. Um, but, okay, good enough, and I'll say that's good. Uh, and this is a separate layer, so I can just bake it down. Actually, I should have, before I did that, I'll just undo that. I feel like uh, I should have stretched out the forehead a bit more. Come on. Uh-oh. Control-Z. Control-Z. There, I think I got it back. Oh, I forgot all my freaking stuff goes away when I do that. You see all this crap up in here? Let's just erase that. Yeah, when you go and you undo your, uh, your slurps, it undoes all of your slurps, so that's kind of a pain in the ass. So you want to think a little bit more bulky first, getting moving things around. Uh, in big ways and then going in and doing little tweaks and hopefully you don't undo um, or you can just layer over top and make another layer um, what time are we at 14 minute mark okay let's try this again okay that's I'm gonna call that good enough because I'm trying to just finish this off I could spend a long time tweaking this all up okay great let's bake that Okay, and how does that look when I move it around? That's starting to get somewhere. Okay, and um, 
Also, maybe I'll just switch to other objects so I can go in here and I can grab my eyes. And if I have my eyes selected, and I'll just make sure they are officially selected. If I go here and get the select tool, double click, just go in here and check on the eyes. There we go. Now they're selected and I can probably see them over here. Wonderful. And I'll go and I'll put on the uh, mirror here on the X. And if I go and I put on the, um, let's see, I hit five, it'll go to the front view. Maybe as I'm doing this, uh, we could hide my body. So I'm going to go to objects and I'll just turn off the body. All right, so we're just looking at the eyes. Let's go to image manager. I'll bring in this lovely one. <coughs> and let's see. I think this one looks like it belongs right there. Okay, it looks like his eye is going to be really big, so I'm going to do something like that. And um, then let's just rub that on. Okay, it's hitting both of them at the same time. There's things i got to fix in here for sure, but here, let's just hit B and bake it. Oh, and something decided to freak out when I did that. Um, <clears throat> Let's go to back to objects and I'll bring back in my body. <clears throat> okay, and I think yeah, that's good enough for now. I got to get rid of some of those those reflections that they've got in the eyes. Um and if I wanted to, I could go ahead and I'll hit 5 again. Actually, I could flick back to my body. And this is going to take me a fair bit of time, but just for fun, We'll do one more of these crazy slurpy ones here. Um, if I go and I turn off my reflections, uh, no reflection. And do I have a nice body I can throw on here? Oh, there it is. So I'll go to the image manager and I'm just going to lock this thing here. You can also turn on here and that way when you hit this, it'll open and close it. Um, <clears throat> let's bring this in. Duke. Okay, and let's pull that in here. That's not big enough, so I'm just going to reset the image. Okay. Okay, great, and let's rub that on. Oh, nice. Okay, that looks really bad, but at the same time, uh, let's go in here and put another layer. No, this is going to be wonderful. Um, I'm just going to get my slurp tool. Let's make it bigger. And uh, hopefully this can line up with some of my sculpting. Uh, there. La, 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 la. Try not to get too much from just the side here. <coughs> it's nice that he has some underwear on. Really nice underwear. Okay. And again, I'm slurping all over the place. I could probably get some other pictures here. Um, you know, like if I want to do a close-up on the chest, I could probably do that. I'm just going to be goofy. And uh, go in here and I'll, I'm just going to erase this chunk out of here because it's just bad. Okay. Go back to slurping. And this arm I'm not crazy about already. I'm going to have to go and do some more painting over it. This is going to take a little while though, so I'm skipping over it. Fast, fast, fast. Get that thigh in there. <laughs> All those lovely veins and legs. These are things you're never going to see. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and bake that. <laughs> okay, and uh, I can do the same for the back side. And what else do I want to do in here? Um, maybe I'll do some neck cleanup. So the neck is looking kind of obnoxious. And don't forget that if I go to the image manager, I can just grab this big piece of skin. You can take photographs of your own skin. I don't know if I really want to see those, to be honest. Um, but I can just go in here and even if I went in and instead of uh, doing it across the whole character, what if I... I'm not sure why I keep zooming way in like this. There's something I'm missing that I'm doing. I can just take this and... Uh, my neck's right there. What if I go and I take this this piece of skin 
and I kind of size it up a little bit. Let's make my brush smaller. And I can't remember if I put another layer on here or not. It can never hurt. Um, <clears throat> and I can rub that on. And there I got that piece on my neck. And oh, I need to bake that on. Oh, that's for looking really horrible. Um, I might want to grab some other photographs for this. Too much, too much hair. But you get the idea. Um, I'll blend it in. Anyway, that's me just starting to set up doing some texturing, and I'll make another video of this later on. I'm going to stop here.